625 will pack up the moving boxes as people continue to struggle to make it in the Bay. There are a record number of people looking to leave the San Francisco Bay Area as a whole, even as our state is transitioning out of the pandemic. Redfin just completed a study and San Francisco is number one in the country for people considering moving away. I spoke with Redfin chief economist Daryl Fairweather to find out why. People are looking for places that are more affordable, especially with inflation getting higher and housing costs getting higher. It's just not affordable for a lot of people to stay in the Bay Area. So we saw a lot of people leave the area when they had that opportunity to work from home. I mean, I know a lot of people from San Francisco, they moved up to Tahoe, for example. So now that people are returning to the office, we're still seeing this uptick? Yes, yeah, during the pandemic, people were moving because of a lifestyle change. Maybe they wanted to live somewhere that had more natural beauty or they wanted to be closer to family. But now people are moving because they've simply been priced out. Home prices are up 15% nationwide from last year. Rents are up 14%. And it's especially expensive in a place like the Bay Area that has always been more expensive than the rest of the country. So that's motivating a lot of people to move somewhere else where they'll just have more disposable income. So where are people looking to move? It is Sacramento is the number one in-state location, and then Seattle is the number one out-of-state location for people leaving the Bay Area. Oh, that's interesting, because I would thought you'd say for sure Arizona, Texas. We saw a lot of people moving there. Idaho. Well, it's in, yeah. If, if, if you look at Austin, for example, most of the people moving in from out of state are coming from the Bay Area. But the Bay Area is sending people all over the country, so everybody is kind of complaining about Californians moving in.